And I mean, it's getting close to an order of magnitude faster, right? That's pretty cool. I'm Agrin Hillemschil. I am a senior data scientist in the Peltaren AI research team. Uh, Peltaren is one of the partners of AI Sweden. The project we did on the A100 uh, is a uh, research project uh, within uh, Medbert. We're looking at uh, a technique called federated learning. Uh, and this is a method for uh, training models on data without actually moving the data and taking it out from the site. And this is super useful if you have something like devices or something that has data on it and you don't want to export the data. Or as is the case for us, uh, you have hospitals and you have data in the hospitals that you won't, don't want to leave the premise. Then you can use something like federated learning to actually uh, enable you to build a model on top of that, but without exposing the data outwards. Uh, we work together with RICE. On this paper, it was uh, me and two of my colleagues and uh, uh, some people from RICE as well. I mean, it's kind of cool how, how fast it is, honestly. I, I did not expect this type of speed up. Um, the way we're using the GPUs is we are co-locating um, sites or clients, um, as you could call it. And it's surprising that despite us doing this, we get these really big speed ups. So as I said, eight times faster is not what I expected. And, and at that point, we haven't really done any type of optimization. So if you have the A100 and you're only using the A100, uh, there are a lot of optimizations you can do to make it run even faster. And I mean, it's getting close to an order of magnitude faster, right? That's pretty cool. We were doing federated learning and we were simulating a varying number of clients. Um, and for each GPU, we could place a number of clients. Uh, this depended on how big the model is and how much video memory we have. And the A100 has a really big video memory, so we could fit up to eight sites per GPU. This was super helpful because this allowed us to uh, essentially simulate a really big number of clients um, for each run. And we could also have multiple runs uh, coexisting together spread out across all the GPUs. Yeah. I mean, we're trying to make it easier to use AI. And part of that is making sure uh, that we can um, you know, use AI when data is not always available or not available in big masses. We want to make sure that it becomes cheap enough uh, to actually be used by everyone. And we want to make sure that it respects the privacy of its users so that it can be applied in a safe way everywhere.